All right, we're having fun here. This is a fun thing. All right, let's go to a ColecoVision title because we are playing on a ColecoVision and we have the Atari 2600 attachment. And when you have the Atari 2600 attachment, you have Straight to pull out. it out yep. of the console in order to gain access to the ColecoVision part. Now we're going to play on some Donkey Kong for the ColecoVision. Okay, that sounds cool. There we go. So, for all of you who are actually not believing we're on a ColecoVision, we are. Yay. You have to press one, maybe? I did press one. It's not... It's not loading, is it? Oh, there it goes. It. There it goes. I'm impatient. Yes, I want to play are. Donkey Kong. Come on, jump man, let's go. Get... Okay, the control on this... Oh, sh shoot. Now, the controller might not be the best in the world, because it's old. I might have to change controllers and see if that'll help, but I think Use once this. I get... Should once we I get try nice switching it, out with, like, a Sega controller, maybe? Yeah, we could. Just want to have the numpad, which I don't... isn't really needed for this game. Oh, nice job. I think if you double tap the up button, you climb ladders a lot faster. Yay! So that always comes in handy when you double tap to go up. Mario's got to accessorize, dang it. Get that handbag and that Spanish hat. Sombrero. Well, the whole idea is that uh, Pauline has left her goods behind, and if you get if you pick them up for her, then you get extra points. I know, I just think it's funny to think of it that way. That's all. Meanwhile, Mario's thinking, God, woman, can't you keep better track of your stuff? I have to rescue you and your items? What am Whoa, oh, no! Shit. No, the fireball got me! That's not fair. After I picked up all of those items for her, now I gotta do it again. Women. Can't live with them, can't shoot them. You know, this is very inaccurate. A woman wouldn't let him touch his, her handbag. He'd say, she'd say, oh, bring I know. it to me. Bring me my handbag. Don't look inside of it. You could be, you could be, um, being held at gunpoint, and she, and like, she'd be like that. And it's like, I need a, I need twenty bucks to get this guy, or he'll shoot me. And she'll say, bring me my handbag. Yeah, get that. You know what's really embarrassing is if you're out in public with your wife or your mom or whatever, and she says. Will you hold my bag for me while I go into the bathroom? Yeah, sure, Mom. Yeah, make me look like a transvestite mom. I remember my mom used to have me do that all the time at the store. She's like, can you have my bag? I gotta go to the bathroom. I like this version because you don't have to deal with all the Spray springboards. Things. Yeah. Just the fireballs. Those are your only obstacle. That and falling. You seem more obnoxious in this one, the fireballs. But at least in this version, you can free fall onto another platform and it'll allow it. Yeah. Okay. Get away from me, you dumb fireball. No, this way. Okay, good. Okay, you can have that purse. I don't want it. Sorry, Pauline. I did not grab your purse. <laughs> You're gonna have to buy another one. I know that was a Louis Vuitton, but that's, that's your problem. Shouldn't have brought it with you. You know, she wants to pick up her cleaning, <laughs> cleaning, uh, her dry cleaning <laughs> for you. Dry cleaning, that's exactly what she'll have you do next. Thanks, Mario, for rescuing me. Now, would you be a dear and pick up my dry cleaning? Here's the bill. Oh, you know, she did appear in another game until, like, what, like, 20, 2009-ish? Oh, really? Yeah. Pauline? Yeah. Huh. So, she's really important, you know? At least Mario is to her. I used to play this game a lot in the 80s. So I had a friend who lived down the street and had this uh, ColecoVision. I would play this all the time over at his house. I would always be on Donkey Kong. Nice. And then I had another friend who lived around the corner from me who had an Intellivision, and I would, me and him would always play Burger Time on it. Nice. And that's one th console I would love to get to is an Intellivision. Oh, oh, I fell. I did not register a jump. But hey, you know, I got four lives. I made it this far without dying, so I'm doing actually pretty pretty well. Yeah. Parasol. Oh, that was close! That was too close for comfort. No, 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 no! I jumped off! Jump off, Mario! Can you pause it? No. 
this was in an area where before there was a pause feature on video games, you had to play through the entire video game, get game over, before you... Ooh, I free fall. That was there. nice. I was going to say, because I remember the Atari 5200 did, but I didn't know. Yeah, that, I think they started adding pause in, like, Atari 5200, but... Which was a very nice feature, because it was, like, right there on the, on the uh, controller. Oh, yeah. Okay, that fireball is away. Now I have to deal with that one. Of course, only in Nintendo. Oh, frig! See what happens when I try to go after your handbag, Pauline? <laughs> she don't care. She doesn't she care. Just she just wants it. She, she wants it because she doesn't have to shell out for another Prada. Mario, be a deer and go get me that bag. <laughs> Pauline, be a deer and... <laughs> go kill yourself. <laughs> go jump off the lake. <laughs> What? <laughs> go jump off, go the jump off the lake. Okay. Yeah, go jump into the <laughs> lake. Go play on the freeway. Do something. <laughs> go occupy your time. But don't get captured by Donkey Kong anymore. Yeah, I don't know how she continuously stays in his captive the whole time. You're buying another handbag, woman. <laughs> I'm not getting that one for you. That's too dangerous. You know, I never did get... You never... I like, I like the hammer when you, like, just stand there and have the barrels just roll right into you. Oh, I know. Okay, now... Come on, barrels. Oh, good. I'm just surprised at the graphics of this thing. That surprises me. Oh, yeah. In the Atari 26 version... It looks like Donkey Kong is rolling chocolate chip cookies at you. <laughs> yes. I always just say, jump over the cookies! Jump over the cookies! That's no form. All right, well, that's that's why that's why they kill you so fast, because, you know, they're too dry. That's a good point. They make you choke. <laughs> Seriously, that one on the one below you, that looks like a sombrero. That's all I can think of it. Oh, that's, that's, a, that's a, like a lady's, like, spring hat or something. Yeah, like it is. Easter but I'm just saying, here it looks like a sombrero. It looks like a UFO to me. You know what does look like a UFO too? Like, Pauline, you're leaving your UFOs all over the place. How dare you, woman. Pauline. Shut up, Pauline. Go make me a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Yeah, so true. No wonder why she lets a big gorilla go capture her. It's better than living with Mario. <laughs> <laughs> hey. hey, all we can do is just some plumbing, I mean... No, that doesn't sound. Yep, uh, there's my score, twenty-eight thousand five hundred. Can you beat that? Maybe switch them out. See, like switch out the controllers. See if maybe the other one works better. Yeah, I'll do that. See, that's the beauty part about the ColecoVision. You can switch out the controllers, but unfortunately for the Intellivision, they're grafted into the system. So you'd have to know your electronics in order to switch out the controllers. Because if they ever break down. <laughs> You gotta get a new, new console. Yep. Yep, yep. What a pain. Alright, I know you go in there. Why aren't you going in? <laughs> Come on, controller. Does it say up on the thing whenever you try to put it in? I'm, I pulled it directly out. So it should be in the same direction. Okay. I know I had a difference of time getting it back in last the other day. Oh, yeah. Okay, come on. You can do it. There we go. I knew you could do it. All right, try that. I swear, that's as big as an Xbox One, this ColecoVision is. Oh, yeah. Anyway, there's that. Okay. I'll just sit over it a little bit like this. Yeah, I'll plug the other one into port number two. Press this. Press these. Oh, maybe I'll press go. reset. Yeah, press reset. Okay. Actually, hit number two. We'll play two-player. Okay, that'll be fun. It'll be ye gay old time once it loads. This one might not have two player. It does. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, you, you got really it. have to press down hard. Oh my gosh, I'm afraid I'm gonna break it. Well, that's the beauty part of this is like you can push down really hard on it. Oh, come on. And okay, that's a little bit easier. Wow. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's not moving. Okay. Yeah, I just push my thumb down on it. Okay, I'm gonna... Like that. 
I'm gonna do that. But yeah. It's my turn. This is like. It's still my turn. Oh, I was not. Oh, wait, what, what happened? I thought we hit two. We did, there's only one. What is going on at this? I don't know. Something's going on with the interference or something. Let's try this again. I mean, because I was hitting the. I hit the thing. Because, like. Let's move this a little bit closer. Oops. And there goes the reception. Okay. One second. Let me stand up. Uh, alrighty. Oh, it came out. Why is it going around there? Let's see. That back in. Alright. Okay, yeah, there's no... Because usually it'll say one or two player. I think it's just one player only. No, that's impossible. We played two player before. See, it, it appeared briefly, and now it's... So we should be in two-player mode now. Let's see, can I jump with this one? Yeah, it's the left mountain okay. button. Okay, that's a little easier. Ow! I jump. Too little easier. <laughs> oh, it still went up, what the heck? Oh wait, no, oh, wait. Maybe you have to die first. Like, fully, like, game over. Maybe we should read the, uh, because I think we've hit the button too fast before that screen actually let us read what the selections were. Well, we could just, like, press reset, but they, I don't remember there's being a selection screen, but... There is. You just have to wait for it. It takes a while before it to uh, come up. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'll take my hands off. Oh. Okay, so, there's the start loading screen, and then after you see this for a while, then it should switch to the selection screen to show you what you're selecting. Okay. Oh, there it is. Okay. Five. That's it. No, wait, 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 wait. Skill one, two player. Yeah, five. There we go. Now we're in two player mode. Is it my turn? Yes, you're turning your on player one. I'm on player two. Okay, now we have to go back to the 80s where we call each other player one and player two. Come on, player two, it's your turn. Oh, why did I jump so late? Hmm. Hit the wrong button. Maybe. I don't know. I'm getting so confused. All right, player two. That's what I like to see. Two up. There we go. I guess after you use these controllers after a while, they kind of start working again a lot better. Yeah. Like you loosen them it. up or something. I need to get used to it, too. Yeah, you get used to them. Timing's different on this one than the other ones, too, like the jumping. Ooh, that was a close one. That was really close. All right, level two. There's your purse. There's your UFO. <laughs> I guess it's a good thing Pauline doesn't get abducted by UFOs. Yep. You have to fight aliens. You surf enough of them on Tapper. That's not the truth. That's another game I'd like to get on ColecoVision is Tapper. <laughs> That'd be cool. That was fun. Yeah, I like Tapper. Ah, no, you don't! No, you don't! No! Not fair, there was a hammer right there. I could have just grabbed you and been done with you. Yeah, you should have, too. Yeah. Oh, I can't use the keypad. That would have been nice. No, that's just for selection. I did it. I'm special! Double tap up, you can go up the ladders faster. Oh. I'm barely getting over them as it is. <laughs> oh! Ouch. Dang it. Trip in the barrel, fantastic. Whoa! Jumped over a fireball and the plug, and I still got killed. Yep, you did. Because I had to be an idiot and go back for the, uh, the UFO. <laughs> Extra points! Exactly. Points matter in the 80s! Yep. Nowadays we don't give one crap about them. Why did you do that? Well, yeah, at least you know, clear out some barrels. Yep. Okay, get ready, it's gonna disappear. Yep. Ah, Couldn't get to the ladder fast enough. I'll take that just so I can... Yeah. 
Prada purse, there's your UFO. Go down, go down, go down, go down. Now you can go up. Playing with fire here. Playing with fire. No, 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 not that fire. Literally and metaphorically. Oh, now I'm trapped. Oh, no, no, no! No! What a way to get trapped. A fireball to the left of me, fireball in a pit to the right of me, or no other way around it. Just <laughs> die. <laughs> Just die. Just die. Take your death like a man and pick one. No, like a plumber. See, I could, I could get burned by a fireball, get burned by another fireball, or fall down a pit. <laughs> I'll have one of both each, please, and also, damn it. This is... Jesse's got a bone. Yep. Jesse's got a bone. I started chewing on the couch over there. It's like, okay, what are you munching on? Carpet. Drop it, drop it. <laughs> oh, I know. Always grabbing stuff that doesn't belong to her. Whereas it would really be bad to have a dog that picks up anything off the floor, starts chewing on it, and the moment you try to take it away from him, it start growling at you. Yeah. Like, no, you're not supposed to have it. Okay, I'll let you have it for a while. <laughs> Yay, now I made it to the elevator room. Yay. Grab the parasol. Oh, great, right into the fireball. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice placement there, Donkey Kong. Yeah, good job. <sighs> Gotta dig that loop. Oh, I know, right? <laughs> Come on, let me go up the ladder. Damn Ooh. it! That's your bad luck spot. I noticed that you, like, die there a lot. Yeah, this time in this level, double tapping comes in mighty handy, especially when you're being pursued by a fireball. And we can all thank ColecoVision for not putting in those damn springboards. Oh yeah. Because I like to take my time in this area. You know, it's there's a lot of pitfalls to be uh, falling down into. Oh, I agree completely. She can get a new purse. I don't care. <laughs> In fact, even on the ColecoVision, the purse looks like a phone. Doesn't it, though? I always thought it did, too. It looks like the fireballs looks like kind of merge into you. Yeah, it does. That was useful. Yep. Back to the elevators again. Oh no, I got squished! Oh! That fireball. I could have jumped over it. could have. I could have taken him. Yeah, you could have. Oh wait, I go get- Oh, that's right, because you died too many times. Oh, I got an extra I life. Sad. I suck. <laughs> oh! Oh, too full of a free fall. Too far of a free too fall. Too full of a free too fall. Too far of a free fall. Wow. Well, that's game, and I think I won this one. You got 1,300, I got 18,000. I love how it switches scores so you can compare. Yeah, that's nice. I love that. Mm, yeah. All right, that was Donkey Kong on the ColecoVision.